and welcome back to another video. Today we'll be taking a look at Advanced Power Suits Add-on. Uh ah, yeah. Uh so this looks cool. Um I don't know if it's the same add-on, but I remember Oh, uh, what was the series called? In Duncan's Oh, Duncan had this like series. There was him, Lewis and Simon, there was Sips and Shin, and there was uh, another guy, I can't remember his name. And they had like a power suit, power armor suit, like add on in, uh, well, more than that. Um, and I wonder, I don't know if it's made by the same people, it did remind me of that. Lily song laid on the floor. It's RTX on, I didn't take that. No, I don't think it is. No, it is. Oh, wait, no, not saving quick. God damn it. Did I only press a button to turn out here at some point? Hmm. That's sad. Alright, goddammit. it. Right, settings. Uh, ba, 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 ba. It would be in video settings. Yeah, why is ray tracing? Weird. Anyway. Uh, advanced power suits and. Oh, that's the mech suits from last uh, video. Oh, you place this. I hate these ones. Right, so. Advanced Power Circuit Machine Suit. Uh, contains crafting, mach crafting machines, components, abilities, and weapons. Power suits get started. Feedback. So, uh, we need the, uh, the circuit machine to create advanced circuits. So, that's three for five iron and an iron block. Iron block. One, two, three. Five. Uh, one redstone dust and two green dye. Um, I don't have any green dye, so I'm just gonna give myself two. Give that P green. Duh. There we go. Two. Why does it keep giving me this? Oh, maybe I just picked up again. Anyway. Uh, so let's craft out first. So we've got the circuit machine. Uh, I don't know why that needs the thing that I don't have. Uh, oh. And I just break this. Yes, I can. Okay, he does not want to place the way I want it to place. There you go, that'll do. So you right click this and this will let us create advanced circuits, which is a metal plate, four green dye and two redstone dust. I'm just going to go give myself a stack of that green dye because I might need it. Next up is the plate compressor, which is two dust, five iron and a redstone and an iron block, and two dust. So two dust, glass block. So let's get the glass block, which is up here. Also, the music is really loud. Let me turn that down. 45%. Well, that's uh, settings. Uh, audio, music. There we go. Now I can actually hear myself think. And then two of them. And 
and we can craft the plate compressor. So let's put this down over here. Then we have the coal fabricator, which is uh, uh, seven iron ingots, a redstone dust, and an iron block. One redstone block, dust, one iron block. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven ingots. And we can make the co coil fabricator. Uh, next up, we need the armor armor assembler, which is a crafting table, seven iron ingots, and an iron block. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and the crafting table. Boom, and we craft that up. Armor assembler. And we can place that down there. So we need advanced circuits in the in there. So we need that plate. So that plate would be made in here. So we can craft the metal plate from eight iron ingots and one cobblestone. So one cobblestone and eight iron ingots. So we put that in there. Oh, it doesn't give us a cool animation, unfortunately. I would have preferred if this was like a uh, was more like a furnace, where you put the uh, iron ingots in one slot, the cobblestone in another slot, and then it would uh, uh, press them together or something. Or we would just use or instead of or just get rid of the cobblestone and make it so that one metal plate is like two in iron ingots or something. So we have that metal plate. So now we need. Uh, uh, Two redstone dust because I cheated in the thing already. So two redstone dust. And then we can make one advanced circuit. So this is actually quite good because it's given use to uh, green dye, which has very limited uses outside of building. Uh, you need a Tesla coil in the coil fabricator, which is for those plates and the, the two redstone dust. So I'm just gonna give at p metal plate 64, and I'm gonna give myself advanced circuit. Let's take an advanced circuit as well. Advanced. Advanced. Circuit 63. So, coil fabricator. So, we need two redstone dust. One, two. And then we can craft a Tesla coil. Next up is the Power blade. So that's in the crafting table a stick, a advanced circuit, and a Tesla coil. I'm just going to give myself 64 Tesla coils. 63 Tes. 63. So I need a stick, which is this one. And uh, switch that to craftable, and we make the power blade. It has 20 attack damage, which that's not super expensive for 20 attack damage. Because that's uh, what is that? So that's it, well, except not including the materials crafted. So that's a one eight is so that's so each plate is eight ingots. So that's four plates and two dust and the. Uh, so that's five plates, so eight times five. Eight, eight, five is forty. I could have just I could have done that. Anyway, 
There's like 40 iron ingots, which isn't super expensive, but isn't super cheap either. Yeah, that's a power blade. Can this be enchanted? Let me see. Game mood one. Enchanted book. Let power blade enchanted book. No, it cannot be enchanted. Anyway, it does 20 attack damage. Which is pretty good because with it, uh, a Manulian Cleaver does 27 fully enchanted. Uh, let's summon a witch. <laughs> I am doing way more damage because this uh, armor set gives me strength. Yeah, uh, next up is the Plasma Cube, which is four glass around the, the, a Tesla coil. I know, yeah. One, two, three, four. So, uh, plas four, you get 40 Plasma Cubes in interact. Whoa. Okay, that did a bunch of damage. So these are projectiles. Um, yeah, let me just summon a witch over here. Some... Yeah, witch. So let's get away. Um, oh! Yeah, it annihilated her. Uh, oh, move out of it. Oh, this is pretty good. Uh, you can probably use this against like uh, stuff like the Wither as well. Doesn't say how much it, how much damage it does though. Which uh, we know it's at least twenty because witches have twenty HP. Well, let's see. Could I use this on an Enderman? Um, and, uh, man. Right, if you stay still for a second, I'm just going to throw that. I think he teleported away. At least I'm pretty sure he did. He can't use it on Enderman. Maybe it did kill him, I don't know. Hard to tell. Right, uh, next up is the Fire Cube, which is a flint and steel surrounded by glass, and then there's the Dragon Breath, which is an Ender Pearl surrounded by glass. So. Iron ingot, flint, ender pearl, so flint and steel. Oh, yeah, I only need eight glass. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's the Dragon Breath and Fire Cube. So let's go test these out. Alright, so I'm gonna need to summon another witch here. So uh, the dra oh okay the dragon breath also does tr kills in one shot and I assume this yeah that also does damage. So if you can't kill it kill him in one shot you you're gonna yeah uh, that's gonna be doing damage to them. I right, need to run away and fireball. Oh that it's disappointing that it makes a hole like I. 
I have complained in the past about like um, all of our dons adding weapons and stuff that to destroy the landscape and like mobs and that. And it's just like, yeah, it's annoying, but at least here it's not a mob that spawns randomly that destroys uh, everything. But these are cool to throw. Uh, but yeah, let's move on to the next item. So, the next item is the lightning bolt. Uh, it's a, a lightning rod surrounded by four glass. One, two, three, four. And copper. One. One, two, three. Boom. Lightning bolt. Oi! It does look like. Uh, it does look like. Uh, you're like Zeus uh, with his lightning bolt. Now uh, to smite some. Un. Newing mortals. At this time, I want to summon a villager and see if this transforms some vil villager. Oh, it's a baby. I don't think it'll work with the baby. Oh no, it works with the baby. Okay, this one doesn't do as much damage, but you can. But uh, you can basically like, summon lightning wherever you want. So by some moo. I'm in the mushroom. I don't want to wave a mushroom. I want a brown mushroom. And now you have a brown mushroom. So yeah, this is uh, quite useful. Uh, and the, and so far, I don't think any of this would be impossible to get out. Uh, well, no, yeah, I don't think anything's impossible to get to, on Superflat because you can get copper from drowned and sand from 1DT, and I think you can also get uh, cactus and green dye from 1DT. I think, then I might be wrong on that. You can get redstone and all that, yeah. Oh, well, you can't make this on Superfly because you can't get diamonds. Uh, I'm, I'm the, anyway, we'll just play. Anyway, instant heal. So it's a. A Tesla core, three plates, two advanced circuits, and one diamond. I'm guessing this heals you. There you hold it. What? I die? Why did I die? Well, I guess it technically does heal you by killing you. Are uh, you not supposed to use it on like full health or something? Uh, e f f e c t at p poi poison two right so tap at p effect seconds so for twenty seconds two five five. I think I did the thing where I made it too high so it doesn't actually do any damage to me. Uh, let's try 25. Hold on, yeah, that's gone. No, 25 is too high. So it's still not taking any damage. Hold on, this. Yeah, well, it's not a piece. Yeah. Ah. Yeah, still not taking damage. Maybe if I take off my armor. Yeah, I guess my armor was what was keeping me alive. No, oh, wow, it's dark in here without night vision. Oh, so yeah, if you use on full health, it will kill ya.
But if you're actually damaged, it won't kill you. Oh no, now it's not killing me at all. If I put my armor on, it kills me. Oh, that's an interesting bug. Is it just this armor? Or uh, if I go to game mode 1 and get myself a full set of diamond, will it kill me in diamond armor? Uh, would, uh, all this... Anyway, uh, boom, chest plate, leggings, and boots. Oh, anyway, it would help if I wasn't in creative mode. No, it's not killing me with full diet. I guess it's something like a specific bug with like uh, the elemental set or something. I don't know. That's odd. Also a bit funny. But um, I have helped in the development of an add-on. So I do know like, uh, well, at least the guy that I helped develop with the add-on I was developing when, uh, well, I wasn't developing it, but I was basically, like, bug testing and uh, uh, making sure I didn't break the balance of the game. Um, and basically, uh, the mentality that at least we were doing was uh, is that it's more important to make sure it uh, works fine for vanilla survival rather than uh, cross-compatibility with other add-ons and how other add-ons would affect it. Um, so maybe something like this happened, and they didn't be, and they didn't do like any testing for like other add-ons, so that so it's just like an oversight. So I don't know. Uh, all I can say is that's how, that's how we did it. Um, hold on, I'll be right back. I'm just gonna take a quick break. Okay, I'm back. I just had a quick drink. Anyway, um. So that, that was a, that's a uh, funny and interesting bug. So yeah, be care be careful with that. Um, at least assume it's a bug. This doesn't really tell you anything about the items here. I don't know if it. Were, uh. So I don't know what this part. This bug. Uh, crafting the armor assembly, the nano suit. Oh, so we've got the nano suit, power suit. Giga suit. Na oh, so I get ah. So this on the right is what it gives you. So it gives you free strength, free haste, one speed, uh, one, two, three, five fly, fly power, and the slow fall. So let's start off with this. So head. So you can see there it's metal plates and advanced circuit. Shoulders. Uh, Tesla cores and all that. Knees, and twos. So I'm gonna take uh, my elemental armor off and see how well it compares to the elemental armor. So the uh, power suit on version one point zero point one point one. The helmet alone is full armor bars. Oh, off. Ah, oh, so that gives you two. That gives you two. So that also gives you two. But then the helmet just like gives you, um, like a full set, I guess. Full. So yeah, let's take a look at the arm. Oh, I do like the arm. Oh, is it does have a cool free, like futuristic three D model. So apparently this can fly. Oh yeah, it can fly. Mostly horizontal flight and not vertical flight. Wait, no, vertical, not horizontal. I got it mixed up for a second there. But if I let go of space, I can, so I'll just like slow fall down. And this gives you speed two, haste two, strength four, and slow fall three. Now I one shot an enderman. This sword and armor on. Oh god damn it, why does it keep running away? There he is. 
Yeah, I can. Oh, let me get this, uh... Yeah, it's gonna patch this up a little bit. Yeah, pretty cool. Uh, and obviously you got like haste two, which is uh, permanent haste two, which is uh, the same as like a beacon. So you basically got portable beacon power as well. Cool looking power bleed. Right, next up is the vibro suit. So, uh. Uh, so you can't go back. It would be nice if you could like shift right click to go back. So this gives you uh, more of everything basically. So the super suit. Buddy, where's my super suit? So let's go to... Giga, Aqua, Giga, Astro, Flame, Power, Suit, Toxic, Team, Super, C-U-P, why does it not let me, okay for some reason it does not like me searching for Super, well let's take this off, because I think I'm going to, might need, yeah, anyway, Super Suit, it's a grey die. So I'm guessing I'm going to need four grey dice. So I'm just going to give that P grey. Die. Black, round, cyan. G R A Y. Die. So super suit helmet, shoulders, knees, and ah, uh, used to pull it. So the head uses two, the chest plate uses one, legs uses one, and the feet use one. So power suit on. This is the super suit. It has the same flying, but now we have uh, set. So I think we still have speed three and uh, speed four now. Uh, we've got regen. Haste has been upgraded to haste three. Resist. We now have resistance, which makes it even more incredible. That's resistance two and has strength gone up as well. No, it's still strength one. Hmm. I think they forgot to add the number on the end of the strength thing when they were making this add-on. And I think the strength uh, effect was supposed to increase. Let me see. Uh, what monsters? What monsters? Where are these monsters? Are they on the ground? I bet they're on the ground. So, oh, there's a monster within like 1500 miles of you. So you can't sleep. Yeah, this place got a bit roughed up down here. Last couple of re reviews. So I'm going to light this up a bit because it's too dark. Right, now I can sleep. Beautiful. Yeah. Yeah, 
well, that's them. Why would why would have done this instead of making it use grey dark? Well, if the, if this uh, super suit is like supposed to be an upgrade of the regular power suit, then I made it so that it uses the power suit in the uh, recipe. Also, I'm just gonna jump a bunch of stuff in here. And I should probably check t to see if these can be enchanted, but I very much doubt it. Uh, I need that, I need that. Uh, where's those Tesla things? There they are. And next up is the power suit. Which is redstone dust. So I need one, two, three, four, five redstone dust. Five dust. And... Uh, I picked up the grey dye. It's shoulders, knees and toes. Boom, 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 boom. So this gives you... Oh, you are quite a bit faster. This, you are. Holy poop. This gives you speed. Oh, I guess that number's just glitched on those two. Haste free, strength, regen free, resistance five, and slow falling free. Resistance five is really good because that's a lot of defense. Uh, oh, so if I just like some on Vind. Vindicate. <laughs> He's literally doing no damage to me. Oh, and also the armor doesn't appear to have durability. How much damage do I do to him in a single punch? I one shot with a single punch. Okay, I'm gonna have to test out like this armor and the wet and the sword against like the wither and ender dragon at the end of this. Yeah. Oh, wait. One, two, three. Right, yeah, no, fly power is the same. I do feel like I go up a bit faster, though. Next up is the Giga Suit. Which is... Uh, never Quartz. So that's uh, four, three, four, five Never Quartz. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Giga suit, head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees and toes. Head. I'm getting distracted. Oh, yeah, I think again. You are really fast. Uh, flying is the same. These are cool looking now. I've not, I I didn't check out the other two armor, but these armors are cool looking. This, but the the other two are just like basically, uh, just like color changes. So you yeah, got speed, haste, force, strength, regen six, resistance, and the, the slow fall and free. So I guess once it gets to pass like, um, resistance five, it can't. It just de it just doesn't show the number. But yeah, still not taking any damage. I still one shot with a single hit. Wee. Oh. There we go. Yeah, this is maxed out strength, resistance, and haste. It's maxed out regen. Speed is almost maxed out, fly power and slow fall hasn't been changes, and fire resi resistance, water beam and night vision hasn't been added. Oh, but now, ah, so we got the deep sea suit that gives you night vision and water breathing get instead of some of the others. So you still get strength and haste and a little bit of speed and fly power and slow fall. But these, this uses water buckets instead. Give that water. Five. 
Uh, head. Uh, am I missing something? Oh, I'm out of plates. Okay. Uh, uh, Tesla coils, metal plates. There you go, head, shoulders, knees, and trues. So you put this on. If I look how cool we are, I am. Like blue, like blue iron man. But yeah, the flying is still not very good. We have speed 2, haste 2, strength 4, water breathing 2, night vision 2, and slave 4 and 2. Now, now, what I would do is I would fuse the water breathing and night vision into just like, uh, in, and just make, instead of giving those two, I would give uh, the conduit power instead. Because the conduit power gives night vision and water breathing, and it also is a little bit better because it gives, uh, a, I think it like, also ups your mining speed underwater. Then we have the tech suit, which gives you strength, maximum strength, a uh, good amount of resistance, a good amount of haste, a, a bit of regen, but it also gives you a lot of speed, and a max fly power, and the, the slow fall. So this is probably the one I, I'd use. It does look cool. So it's lime, die, give, at, be, limb, die, five. It shows his knees and trues. Uh. This really. Oh my god, look how much copper I have in here. I didn't even notice. Alright, so, uh, this, let's check, the flying doesn't seem that much better, like, you can go up quite fast, but you can't really go, you know, horizontal, you can go vertically quite fast, but ho I, when I'm flying, I'm not really often looking to only fly uh, vertically, I also want to go horizontally, and for this, you can't really do horizontal flying, like, as soon as I get in the air, it, like my horizontal momentum completely stops. Like when I let go of space, I can sort of like uh, slow fall down. But I don't know. This, uh, I just, yeah, no. They, the flight needs to be upgraded. Like maybe right. So in my previous reviews, I did a review of the morph corner, which I think is actually on this world. Give at the morph. Okay, yeah, on. yeah, there we go. I must have misspelled small. And in this, uh, it has multiple mobs that can fly. Now, the best mob that can fly is the Ender Dragon. Yeah, you see the power suit's off, and it can fly. And it's way better than uh, than the armor set fly. I think that's probably be because it gives you a bunch of speed while flying. Uh, so that you can actually go so that you can actually go forward at a decent rate. So I probably wouldn't bother making this one until it's like um until there's like an update to making the flying better. Basically. And then there's the toxic suit, which gives you strength, resistance, haste, regen, 
speed and the, well we don't really care about flying power anymore because we know it's not the flying's not very good even at max I use this fermented spider eyes do I even have any of that I might no uh, I have regular spider eyes give that he from fermented spider eyes five I'm not gonna bother crafting another because it's simple to press just take your beat him so herb there. There we go. Alright, so. This one gives you resistance, regen 6, strength, haste 3, speed, slow fallen. So if I saw some... Hey, vin, 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 what? Vindicator. Yeah, it can't do damage to me. And I can still one shot with a punch. Uh. Next up is the Aqua Suit, which gives you full night vision, water breathing, strength, resistance, haste, re and full regen, and nearly full speed. And this uses five diamonds. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, this is probably the one I'd, ma I'd make because the, fl the flying isn't very good, so you don't really care about the... Um, well, that entire like thing was I best is best at flying. Um, yeah. So, yeah. Again, I don't. I would just fuse water breathing and night vision into conduit power. Uh, but yeah, this will give you speed, haste, force, strength, regen 6, resistance, water breathing, night vision, and slow falling. And obviously you can just like, through that, you can kind of just like, slowly fly up. Yeah. Again, don't really care much about uh, the flying, because it's not good anyway. At all. So let's move on to the next armor, uh, which is the flame suit, which yeah just has like strength, haste, fire resistance, speed, fly power, and slow fall. Uh, which is which uses five red dye. Now this is this would be good for the never. Cause the net one, two, three, four, five. Because of the never um you know there's lots of lava. So and if you do a neverite mining this would be good. Bam, 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 bam. Let's take a quick look at it. Yeah. It's cool. Well, like I said, it's, it would be good for the never, but not really anywhere else. Hold on, I'm just going to take these out of here. I must have done a lot of copper mining at some point. Alright, let's go up here. Shift. Shift, right click, there we go. 
that's all them out of my inventory. And I'll just put the 17 in there. There we go. Read up a bunch of space. Anyway. Let's move on to the next one. The nature suit. So this will give you strength. A fair bit of strength, a little bit of resistance, a bit, a fair bit of haste. This will give you two regen, three speed, and five flying and slow fall. So this uses oak saplings. I don't even think I kept my oak saplings. Yeah, I did. Uh, did I? Oh, no, it's one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. There you go there. Bep, bep. Why can't I make the leggings? No oh, way, am I out of... Yeah, I'm out of the plates. No plates. There we go. Kinda looks a bit like Cell. Like perfect Cell. Um, yeah, you get speed 4, haste 3, strength 3, gen, resistance, and slow 4. This is, this is fairly good. Considering I only use this uh, oak saplings. Well, not only oak saplings, but oak saplings and uh, the other tech stuff. It's certainly worse. It's in here. Then we have the Titanium Suit, which is a tier 3 suit, which gives you max strength, max resistance, max haste, but only one speed, fly power, and slow fall. Only one slow fall is enough to stop uh, fall damage. So that's five obsidian by the looks of it. That's never brick. Five obsidian. Boom, 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 boom. So yeah, in this you're basically immortal because you just got like so much resistance and oh, it wasn't this supposed to give me regen. Uh, hey, no, not supposed to give you regen. But yeah, you're not going to really be, really be taking any damage in this if I summon a Vindicator. <laughs> Literally zero damage. <laughs> and you do a ton of damage, so this, this is pretty good for fighting. Then we have the Rose Suit, which is Amethyst Crystals. Do I have any of them? Uh, I'm a fist, I'm a fist, I'm a fist. Hmm. Yes, not. Oh, I might have. Finally. Oh, wait, yeah, here it is. One, two, three, four, five. Boom, 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 boom. I mean, if you like pink, this is this is good. I'm not a fan of the colour pink, really. But you do get slow falling free resistance, regen six, strength, haste four, speed. So yeah, you are basically immortal in this. You could probably fall into the Oh, when yeah, the void has in, does insta kill. It does. Oh, I think it does do insta kill. I uh, could try that. Uh, then you have the royal suit, which is made using gold ingots. It's tier one. You get to max fly power and snowfall, but you get again doesn't really matter. One speed, you get fa max fire resistance, which doesn't really matter because you get uh, you get free haste, free resistance, and the uh, five strength. Yeah, five strength. Let's go some gold and I'll show this off, but I 
Probably when we I wouldn't recommend crafting this because you know yeah, it's not really that good. One, two, three, four, five, like maybe for never exploration. It does have fire resistance, but then again, I think the other one have, might have been better. I can't remember all the stats of my head, so well, boom, 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 boom. Bam, 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 bam. Wait for this to wear off. It does look kind of cool. I'm not really, it's more yellow than gold. And you got speed, haste, strength 6, resistance 4, slow fall, yeah. Ah, oh, you can't even fly in it. Guess that's a bug. That's an odd bug though. Oh, anyway. Now let me put these this in there. Then you have the sand suit, which is five sand, which gives you strength, haste, regen, speed, fly power, and slow fall. Which isn't bad with sand. Oh, that's end stone. Sand. Get it out. Oh, here it is. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. Boom. Yeah, kind of cool. I don't mean like the colour brown, but if you like brown, then this is the suit for you. Oh, this is... So, tier 3 never suit, which is 5 flint and seals. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5... This flint, I saw it here earlier. Oh, there it is. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I'm. Whatever. Here. Oh, right, I need to craft them into flint and steels. One, two, three. Yeah. Um, bam, bam, boom. And now, oh well, let me put this flint back before I forget. Oh, god damn it. You. So, yep, this is what it looks like. It looks pretty cool. You have like a flame for a while or something like that. Uh, this has fire resistance, strength, resistance, haste. Yeah, this would be good for like never exploration. Oh, wow. This one just has max everything except for fire resistance. And yeah, oh, this one uses never stars, that's why. So I don't have any other stars, so give at P never star five. Oh, I need more of those plates.
Um, I ask. I got the head and boots. Oh wait, am I missing? Oh, I need more Tesla coils. Give at p tes sixty three. Head, boots, leggings, and chest plate. Boom, 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 boom. Again, I can't fly, and I don't know why. Must be a bug. I just forgot just, to just add the fly function again, not like I really care. It, it, it's not a very good fly function in the first place, but yeah! I do like this armour! Bit too much purple, but it's cool. I, I prefer purple to pink. And you get speed, haste, force, strength, regen 6, resistance, water breathing 2, night vision 2, and slow falling. So if I someone been looking at do it? Regen? Yeah, regen six. <laughs> yeah, this is probably the best in the entire game. Uh don't know if you wanna kill go out of your way to kill all those withers to get it. Five withers to get it, but it, oh he's cool. And yeah, that's it. Yeah, pretty cool. Uh, now, I'll be back in a minute where I'll be fighting the Wither and Ender Dragon. Right, let's fight the Wither! Uh, I am wearing the Astral suit. Um, with... So first I'm just going to use the... Uh, try out these... Uh, Plasma cubes, fire cubes, and dragon breath. See how much damage this does to that. Oh, that did a chunk of damage to him. Uh, sure. Okay. The fly wouldn't actually be too bad here because it means I can go more than one block at a time. Uh, I'll just grab that. So, yeah, that did a decent chunk as well. And the fire one. Yeah. I mean, you could just spam a few of these at home, I'll probably be enough to kill him. He's not taking any damage. No, it doesn't. I, bet, I think he might be immune due to the, uh, due to like when he goes below saying health he becomes immune to projectiles. And now I need to get up there. Uh, there he is. Come on. Oh, get that. Come on, dude. Just cooperate with me. Why can't I please support me? Nah, you can't place a block beneath you. Alright, come here. Come here! I'm gonna hit you. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna need to summon another river just to test it out one more time. Summon river. One shot with the uh, power blade. Let's summon another one, and I want to see how many hits it'll take with the Manulian cleaver.
Okay. Didn't do that much more damage. But now he's dead. Oh, I dropped multiple weather stars from my manuring cleaver. Neat. He dropped like five of uh, never stars from my manuring cleaver. <laughs> Didn't know that could happen. I thought it was hard to only ever drop one never star, but yeah. Uh, I'll be back again with Alien and the Dragon Fight. Okay, I'm back. Let's do an Ender Dragon Fight. Um, and uh, Dragon. So, let's wait for it to get down here. Come on! Come down here, you cowardly dragon! Stupid enderman. Go away. Oh, dragon's here! And dragon's dead. Yeah, the, this uh, this passage does just let you kill everything. Can I kill? How many punches does it take to kill Enderman? One punch. Uh, so I now want to try and see if he can survive the void in this. So I'm pretty sure in Bedrock is a just. It just kills you. Uh, no, uh, well, I'll say the point. It just kills you. Oh, I I can out regen it, and now I'm running around on the floor at the end. Yeah, it yeah, it's pretty much impossible to die. Yeah, well, I think after a well, not impossible. I think after a certain point it do, of being down here, we'll just be like, okay, slash kill or something. That could be wrong. Could be you uh, misremembering or just be wrong about that. Is that water? There's water there. Don't know how there's water there. Anyway, so yeah, this is a really cool add-on, and it and it, it's more and uh, I do like it because it's an end game kind of thing, which. Uh, I do like uh, st more endgame stuff being added there because it, yeah, it's always fun to uh, do have more stuff to do in the end game. Um, so yeah, it's cool. It has a cool sword. It has cool armor that uh, have really cool effects, and some are easier to get than others. Uh, so yeah, um, I do really like it. So yeah, I hope you guys all did enjoy this video. I hope to see you guys in the next video. And bye bye